Hi and welcome to my channel. I'm going to be honest, I have been shopping for the holidays since December 26th of last year. However, it did not feel like the holiday season until this weekend as Target put out their holiday items. So I have a haul for you, basically some items from the Target dollar spot as well as Target holiday items that they have in the back of the store as well as a couple of apparel items which I never do in my videos as well as a few items that I picked up as a result of the 70% off that they had for some of the fall um, and items that they've had out since summer. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. So in the Target dollar spot, I found some cute cosmetic cases. Now these, these can be used as makeup bags, but they all, can also be used as um, school supplies. I use stuff like this for my, um, you know, to keep medications and some personal items in here that I don't want exposed in my bucket type totes. But anyways, I picked up this makeup bag in a soft gold and this is $3. So I picked this up as a holiday gift, but of course I had to pick up the same one in the rose gold. So I found those in the Target dollar spot section. In the Target dollar spot section, I also found I also found this makeup case, uh, which is not much bigger. It's about the same size, but these are three dollars. And in the inside, the silver has a gray. So I picked up the silver, also as a gift, as well as the rose gold one. So the rose gold one is also $3 and the inside is also a gray interior. These do not have pockets in the inside, but again, they're pretty good size for $3. Target dollar spot. I also found some of the silver and white twine. Thought that would be fun for gift wrapping. I also picked up some wooden tags, but I might use these as ornaments. These are a beautiful wood a white wood with the uh, black lettering, let it snow, joy, peace, Merry Christmas, believe, tis the season. These were $1, which I thought was a good deal considering there are six tags in there. Grabbed some beautiful shimmering glitter that comes in the little jar. And these are iridescent snowflakes that I thought were super beautiful. Grabbed those for a dollar the gold washi tape it's called foil tape but this is a washi and I like how it's got the decorative shape there so I grabbed one roll of that in the gold wooden tags which are cute little stars again these would either be fun on top of gifts or even on a tree a smaller tree this is a three count also for a dollar also found these metallic faux leather buckets. Now obviously they're like gifting buckets. The inside is white. This is a really good size. Uh, it's similar to say the plaid ones that they have there at Target. I thought this was a good deal for three dollars. So I grabbed one in the rose gold and of course one in the gold as well. So I grabbed one of each. I also grabbed the wooden ornament that comes in the brown wood with the side trim painted gold. And this was $1, $1 in the Target dollar spot, so I grabbed two. I also found the large brown wooden tree for $3, so I grabbed this as well. I went into like a million stores looking for the uh, dark wooden sleigh, and that is the only thing that I was after that I have not been able to find so far. The I also found these beautiful water bottles. Now, um, if you've seen any of my previous videos, you know that I have tons of tumbler, tumblers and water bottles. However, I just, I couldn't resist. So I got a couple of these as gifts and one of them for myself. This is a water bottle. The bottom has like a plastic coating over the glass and it is a beautiful speckled gold glitter. And the top of the bottle is a twist off and it, the, the cap is um, gold. So you can see there, I picked that up for $5. And then after I had uh, picked up a few of those, 
I found that inside of the store in, I think it was near the party supply area, one of the end caps had this water bottle that basically is an all, this water bottle is an all gold and it also has a twist off and the cap is gold as well. So I picked this one up because it was all gold. I've never seen anything like this uh, and it looked a lot nicer than the ones that I picked up previously at Home Goods TJ Maxx. This one is a 24 ounce and I picked this one up for $10. I picked up the set of drinking glasses and it says they're clear clear glasses that have a script in gold that say making spirits bright now they also had a couple I think the one in copper said joy and peace and then they had a silver one I can't remember what the silver one said but I opted for these because making spirits bright I thought would be fun to accompany a bottle of some type of drink so I thought the two paired together would be a great gift. In that section where I found the all gold water bottle, I also found these zip cases. Now, um, these pouches, I guess they're called, these look like the size of the cosmetic bags, but they're flat, so they don't quite fit as much, but the color is more pronounced. Again, it's smaller, but it's deeper. There is a linen inside and these were also ten dollars so i got these for myself since they're slim and i can easily put these into the side of my tote um, to find items a little bit quicker so i grabbed one of these in the metallic gold so i grabbed one in the gold and then i grabbed one also in the rose gold I'll grab this cute little plaid pouch that has black brown white and a splash of red um, I thought these would be fun to put something inside for my dad and my brother for the holidays so for a dollar each I grabbed two I grabbed a set of the uh, pantry labels for one dollar I grabbed some gold and clear gifting tags I grabbed the silver embellished gift tags also a sister told me that for uh, the holiday she was going to be purchasing her son and daughter new um, iPhones so I went ahead and picked up a uh, power pack for charging in a silver in a gold, in a rose gold, and this rose gold is more pronounced than the pinky champagne color that they had last year. And then I picked up the iridescent glitter one with the silver cap and they were all $5. So I also picked up some cases. So I picked up the matching case for the iPhone 7 in gold. I picked up a similar one in the rose gold. I picked up a case in the silver. I picked up a clear case with the iridescent glitter. Picked up some of the um, the hooks to um, be able to hold on to phones or use it as a stand. I grabbed the one in the gold and I grabbed the one in the silver. I also grabbed the twist and hold stand Oh, and I don't know if I said this, but the cases were $5 and the stand and holders were $5 each. I also, um, as I was saying, grabbed the twist and hold stand for myself in the marble. And I grabbed also this cute little wooden reindeer ornament, also for a dollar at the dollar spot. The items that I picked up as stocking stuffers were a gingerbread flavored lip gloss, also from the dollar spot. I grabbed the sugar cookie lip gloss. I grabbed the hot chocolate flavored lip balm. I grabbed the peppermint flavored lip gloss. 
I grabbed, uh, this was there previously, but I did grab the Star Wars pin that has the stamper as a stocking stuffer. I also grabbed the Jelly Belly Star Wars candy. And then at the front checkout line where they normally have the champagne flavored gourmet gum from Project 7, I grabbed the Fairy Tale Fruit, which has the picture of the unicorn and it's also the gourmet gum. I thought that would be fun as well. It's normally a majority of the items that I get for the holidays are Target. This year I had already picked up tons of stuff from Hobby Lobby and the Dollar Tree that when I got to Target, a majority of the items that I actually liked from Target were the same things that I had picked up at the Dollar Tree for a fraction of the price. Tons of stuff like uh, gift boxes, certain types of ornaments, everything that I saw was um, three to five dollars at Target that I paid a dollar for at the Dollar Tree. So I was excited about uh, saving a lot of money there. Um, and in terms of their holiday decorations and or gift wrap, there's only three different things that I picked up which is unheard of. Like I went to three stores and I thought I would be tempted. Nope, I only grabbed three things from the regular holiday section. Everything else in terms of ornaments or decor or gift wrap stuff I picked up from the dollar spot. So in the store where they had the holiday ornaments, these were the only ones that caught my attention that I could not leave without. Now, if you have seen any of my hauls yet this year, you know that the last thing I need is another reindeer. However, this reindeer is half champagne and a half glistening white. So I picked up two of these. And I only picked up two because they were $3 each. Now I had considered briefly turning one of the um, reindeers that I had gotten from the dollar store into a champagne. And they had a champagne, but it was a large chunky glitter and I didn't want that. I like the fact, fact that this is so shiny and it glistens in the light. Um, I just think it has a nicer, more elegant look than the chunky glitter. So I grabbed two of these. Yeah, I have a little. And um, a couple of years ago, in, af, at the after holiday clearance at Big Lots, I picked up some of the faux diamond ornaments that I use in my on my bedroom tree. Um, but I found some gold. I found these gold diamond ornaments as part of the Wonder Shop at Target for $3. So I picked these up as well. I thought that these would be great for the main tree in my home. And the last item that I found was not in the gift wrap section. It was actually on a display in the apparel section. And that was this um, Wonder Shop tissue paper. Now it comes with 10 sheets in the gold and the silver as well as a marble. Now when I saw this, I thought, oh, for sure this is going to be $3. Nope, it was $1 which makes it, for the first time, a better deal than the Dollar Tree. Because I picked up some gold and silver at the Dollar Tree for a dollar, but it only came with five sheets. And I did pick up some of the marble in all metallic colors um, for, I wanna say, $1.50 after using a coupon at Michael's. But I thought for $1, 10 sheets, two, um, basically in two different metallics, as well as the marble, was a pretty good deal. Okay, so I'm gonna do something that I don't normally do in my videos and that is share with you some apparel. I grabbed some holiday stuff that I wanted to share with you because for me, the holiday season, even though it's probably not as cold here in Arizona as it is probably where you are, um, for me it's all about being comfortable and cozy. So I'm gonna show you some of the fun things that I picked up uh, that you might wanna be on the lookout for as well. So the first of which was a pair of lady slippers that I found in the Target dollar spot section. Now slippers in general are pretty expensive and so I only get them when Target has deals. Um, but for $5 I found these in the Target dollar spot. Now this is a shimmery silver. I mean overall these look gray. Basically they're gray with the little shimmer of um, silver in there and then the gray faux fur. So for $5, I thought that these were super cute to wear around the house. 
So I grabbed those. And then I found these. Um, they're called slipper socks. So they're thicker than wearing just regular socks and they're not as thick and clunky like shoes, like slippers can sometimes be. Um, but they're these faux fur white slipper socks that are super comfortable, super comfortable. Now they had these in I think a, um, a small medium or a medium large and these were These were $6, so I grabbed these in the faux fur white as well as the faux fur black because a majority of the leggings uh, that I picked up are black. I grabbed two sweaters, two sweaters that caught my attention, and they are part of the Fifth Sun brand, and I got both of them in an extra large. Now, when you guys see them, you're gonna understand why I picked them up. <laughs> so this is a large, loose gray sweater in a heather gray, in a heather gray, but it has writing on it in a glittery silver. And I don't know if you can read that, but it says champagne now, resolutions later. I thought that that was so cute. So I picked that up for $19.99. Also grabbed this one, which is the same thing, a really, really light sweater. This one is in black, it's exact same style. And the lettering on this one is a gold metallic. And this one reads, I'll be there in a Prosecco. I thought these were super cute, both $19.99. And again, the Fifth Sun collection. They only went, they had a small, medium, large, and extra large. Um, but I didn't see any larger sizes than that. And none of them were available online, or at least not available online yet. So again, I rarely show apparel on my channel, um, but I thought that those would be fun um, because I did not see them in all of my stores. So in the event that it's something that you wanna take a look for. Okay, and then the last few items that I wanted to show are things that I picked up from 70% off clearance that I thought would be fun. Now two items that I grabbed for myself was the autumn sign in blue. That was $3, so I picked this up for $0.90. Cents. And then the glitter gold candle, which I picked up tons of these last year at the holiday clearance. Um, but this was also $3, which means I picked it up for $0.90. Cents. Okay, and then the last few items I thought would be fun, since they were regularly priced a dollar, I got them for 30 cents each, and I can use some of these for stocking stuffers and some of these in a Valentine's Day package. One of which was the eraser hearts, the page flags, the cute little kitty erasers, the heart-shaped um, pencil sharpeners, the decorative paper clips, and the colorful notes posted and pins. Again, these were all 30 cents. I thought for 30 cents, why not? I can throw those into a couple of uh, stockings as well as Valentine's Day packages. Um, this weekend in exploring the Target dollar spot as well as what they had in their decorative area, I have never been more excited for Christmas than spending this time and finding these beautiful items at the Target dollar spot. So, if you want to see more holiday hauls, please be sure to subscribe. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for watching. Until next time.